The Pokemon trainer in the original games, and in this one, doesn't talk. I wonder what he'd say if he did, but uh, he's like a 10 year old kid. I don't think I can voice this one. Luckily, I think I have a 10 year old boy in stock. Kyle! Yeah, Dad? You're up. Wait, what? Oh, uh, where am I? I must have passed out playing video games again. I need to stop binging on soda and pop rocks. Huh, doesn't look like it set the house on fire this time. Oh, I got an email from Trace. Oh, fun. Pictures of my face photoshopped on the fat Pokemon. Ugh, damn it, Trace. I'm coming up! I'd rather you didn't. Up and at him! I'm already awake! Yeesh! Morning, Chase! Who the hell let you in our house? What's going on? You've got one weird look on your face. Nothing. Just hung over from soda and pop rocks. Ah, never mind that. I couldn't wait any longer, so I came to get you. Couldn't wait any longer for what? Today's finally the big day! You finally hit puberty? We're finally going to get our first Pokémon from Professor Oak and become real trainers! Really? I thought that was a joke! We're ten for crying out loud! Oh, but before we do, you read the email I sent you yesterday, right? Me as fat Pokemon? Yeah, hilarious, man. Mom, are you seriously sending me into the world at 10? Off you go to Professor Oak's lab. This seems really ill-advised. Trace asked the professor to give the two of you Pokemon of your own, didn't he? Seriously, does no one see a problem with this? Mom, I am 10, and even I can tell this is a horrible idea. Ugh, whatever. Oak Pokemon Research Lab. Should have figured it'd be one of the three houses in town. Hey, Trace, where's Oak? Oh, Chase! Professor Oak isn't here. Do you think those Pokeballs hold the Pokemon you and I are supposed to get? It'd be a safe assumption. Two of them, two of us. I can't wait to get mine! Yeah, judging by all the pets you've killed over the years, you're gonna do great. Oak! Okay. Oh, there you are, Oaky. Well, my good Pidgey, thanks for the help. Oh, God, the old coot's talking to animals again. I think I understand you all a bit better now, thanks to this. I'm not sure I want to know. Yo, Oki! Whoops, sorry about that. Oh, if it isn't Chase. Hey, Oki, we've been looking for you. Oh, of course. I promised to give you and Trace Pokemon today, didn't I? Yeah, and if you don't do it soon, I'm pretty sure Trace is going to have an aneurysm. Well, in that case, why don't we head over to... Hmm? You heard that too? What's this? I guess it's a Pokemon. Oh, look at that! Hi there, yellow fuzzball. Aw, oh, man, to catch this thing, we have to depend on my throwing ability? Damn it! Damn it! Gotcha, you funky looking rodent! Uh, hey, Oak! I shoved that thing into a tiny ball! I didn't kill it, did I? That was a pretty fine performance for a first timer, my boy. Damn straight! Why don't you pick up that Pokeball and give the Pikachu you caught a name? A name? Oh, man, I'm bad at names. What in the- Oh god! It's possessed! Every man for himself! Take the old man first! I'm too young to die! Now that's a lively Pokemon if I've ever seen one. Lively? Call an exorcist, you loony moron! Uh... Hey wait! Come back! Oh god! It's gonna kill someone! <sighs> Professor Oak! Those Pokeballs there. I swear there was only two a second ago, but now there are three! That is how math works. A perfectly reasonable reaction, my boy. You see, one of them is a Pikachu that Chase caught just now. Caught? Hit it with a ball? Whatever. So wait, Chase. You caught it yourself? I threw a ball at it, so if that counts, sure. And it's still freaking out. What? I've never seen that happen before. No one has, except Satan. <laughs> How interesting. Interesting? Terrifying? Well, my boy, this is it. Take that Pokeball, and keep good hold of it this time. I never grabbed it the first time before I tried to hop out of my life. Uh, please don't kill me. I'm gonna close my eyes. Um, this ball feels funny. Very furry. Oh, okay. It's a friendly demon rat. Hmm, what a strange Pokemon indeed. It sure doesn't seem to like staying in one place. But it looks as though it's taken a shine to you, Chase. Why not give it a name? No, don't want to get attached. Oh, hey, Mom. Oh, how cute! This is the one you got from the professor? 
Well, actually, I caught this one myself. What? You caught it yourself? That's amazing! I know I can't throw well, Mom. Thanks for rubbing it in. What should I call your new friend? It's a Pikachu. So, Pikachu? Pikachu? It's a lovely Pokemon. Except when it tries to eat your soul. All right, you stupid pigeon. Hold still. Damn it! That is one angry radish. Ah, yes! I caught a vegetable. I know what I'm not eating tonight. You've got a pretty sweet Pokemon with you. Yeah, he's all right. I'll bring along my favorite Pokemon later, so you'd better battle me when I do. Uh, okay. I don't know how I feel about being up six-year-olds. I'll have to think about that. Hi there. Can I heal my Pokemon? I think it might be a demon. The machine is undergoing maintenance. Please come back later. I love you. I mean, thanks. Bye. Ugh, smooth, Chase. Hey, you came up from Pallet Town? Uh, yeah. How did you know that? Are you stalking me? You must know Professor Oak, right? Well, he owns one of the three houses in Pallet Town, so it's a safe assumption. I got a delivery for him, but I really can't leave the Pokemon unattended right now. And? Can I get you to take this to Professor Oak for me? Yeah, sure. It's like a literal minute out of my way. Thanks, kid. Say hi to Professor Oak for me, too. I sure will, creepy stalker man. Whatever your name is. Yo, kid from Pallet Town. How does everyone know I'm from Pallet Town? I'm getting the hell out of here. Go, I'm thirsty. Let's see here, we've got soda, OJ, purple stuff. Oh, hey, Sunny D. Why chase? Back so soon? Yeah, some creeper in Viridian gave me a package for you. I just hope I'm not an accessory now. How is little Pikachu doing? About as useless as ever. Hmm? I said he's useless. Hmm? I said he's useless! Is that package a hearing aid? I think he's lost it, Pikachu. Glad you agree. Wait, what are you doing? Wow! Get it off! Get it off! Goodness me! Pikachu here seems like it's really come to be a true partner to you, Chase. It's currently partnering with my shoulder. I think you've got what it takes to become a great Pokemon trainer. If this is what it takes, I'm out. Hey, Professor Oak! It's about my Eevee! Its moves are... Interrupting. Whoa! Chase? That's so cool! Is it? Is it? Pikachu just rides on you like that? Only one's in heat. Come on, my little mouse parrot. Wait up! What? Come on, Chase. You do know you can do more with Pokemon than just catch them, right? If this is about the shoulder thing, shut up. I'm gonna get it fixed right now. If you're a trainer, you can have Pokemon battles with other trainers, too. You mean we're making these adorable creatures fight each other? What the hell? I'll show you exactly what I mean. Uh... It's battle time! Go, Eevee! Go, Pikachu! Let's see here. He's got a cat that can scratch you. And you can electrocute stuff. So, just do that. What? Did I lose? Well, you tried to make your cat fight a lightning shooting bunny. So yeah, now give me your money before I have him lightning your balls next. Oh jeez. There I went mouthing off like I knew everything, and then I lost. How embarrassing. At least yours isn't trying to mate with your shoulder. Did you enjoy your first taste of battle, young Chase? I enjoy taking Trace's money, if that's what you're asking. Your partner Pikachu seemed to like it. Yeah, he has an insatiable bloodlust. Hey, Chase! Oh, hi there. Oh, just look at Pikachu! You two are already looking like great partners! No, we're not! It's gonna fix in a few minutes. And I've got the perfect little gift for such a great team! Here, take this! Clothes? Um, but they're tiny. What am I supposed to do with these? Try putting that on Pikachu! You can go on an adventure in matching clothes! Never happening. Pika, Pika! Oh, shut up, Rodent. <laughs> it seems like Pikachu wants to play! That's not what this is. Don't forget to show it some love from time to time. We are not those kind of partners, and I'm not that attached. Oh, cool. I get to catch an actual rat. I don't want it. Damn it! What the? I thought you couldn't leave your store. Thanks for helping me out with that parcel. Are you following me, you creeper? The Pokemart is a convenient chain selling all sorts of items. So please, come visit us. Only if you won't be there. Oh, I know. I'll give you a sample. Here you go. Oh, you're not a creeper. You're just a drug dealer. Huh? Trainer's eyes have met. I'll battle you with my favorite Pokemon. I'm going to kick your butt, six-year-old. 
freaking wreck, ghoul kid! Yeah! Now give me all your money! Ah, oh, crap. Hey, Trace. Huh? You look pretty pleased about something, Chase. Yeah, I just beat the crap out of some six-year-old and his crappy Pokemon. Oh, you beat another trainer? Good job! And then I took his money! Kid never saw it coming. You know, people said it was scary and dangerous out in the woods. Then why the hell are all these kids out here? Damn, butterfly, hold still! Damn it! That wasn't so bad. Pewter City. Hey, nice! I was hoping we'd run into each other. Oh, son of a... Hey, Trace! You know there's a Pokemon gen up this way, right, Chase? I do now. You can battle against the gym leader there, and he's seriously strong. How much does he bench? If you want to get stronger, you definitely gotta try to take him on. Eh, all right. I'll kick his ass later. Pikachu got you! Huh, <laughs> jeez, Pikachu. You're ready for a good battle too, huh? Actually, he's still mad at me for getting him fixed. And exercised. Who wouldn't be? Oh, boy. What have I gotten myself into? Hiya! You're here to challenge the gym, aren't you? Kinda of second-guessing that. This is Pewter City Gym! I'm aware. Trainers here are a bit different from those you face so far. Huh? Did I just bring Pokemon to a gunfight? Um, go get a vegetable! Holy crap! Eat your vegetables, apparently! Cause that crap hits hard! Stop right there, kid! Okay... You're 10,000 light years from facing Brock. Um, I'm more like 10 steps from facing Brock. So you're here. I'm Brock, Pewter City's gym leader. I'm Chase, kid with a Pikachu on his shoulder. You can see just by looking at my Pokemon how rock hard my willpower is. <laughs> That's not where I took that. My Pokemon are all hard as rock and have true grit determination. <laughs> that is not where I took that. That's right. My Pokemon are all rock types. Oh, that makes more sense. <laughs> You're going to challenge me even knowing that you'll lose? Well, that's a bit arrogant. That's what a trainer's honor demands. I don't think that's true. So be it. Show me your best. I hope you like vegetables. Freaking Rex! It seems I underestimated you. Damn straight! As proof of your victory, take an official Pokemon League badge. A boulder badge. Oh, thanks. You got a trash can around here? Oh, you like that one, Pikachu? Yeah! I'm starting to like you, Fuzzball. <laughs>